starting out in a G50 series. We have the single airfield. Let's see what happens. As you can see right off, I'm trying to gain altitude. I'm still in the Tier 1 sections for the German aircraft. Still taking my time, having some fun with it. I've actually been enjoying some of them. The G-50 series, I believe, have 12 7mm machine guns. Not quite up to the quote-unquote cannon title yet, but they still hurt. So what I'm doing is I'm trying to gain altitude, I'm trying to pick off a target, and it looks like I just found a target. Oh yeah! Big huge Catalina to shoot at. One thing you want to do with bombers and with most bombing type aircraft is you don't want to sit behind them where they have hell gunners. You will see for obvious standards. Like just now. The best way to attack a, a bomber is outside their gun range, outside their gun views, however you want to call that. So, yes, that Catalina just took out my engine. That is why you don't want to attack bombers from the back. The best way to do it is, if it's like a Catalina, strafing from the front, the top is a good option too. Um, the belly, if they don't have belly gunners, the Catalina has a tail gunner and two waist gunners, so the best place to attack a Catalina? Definitely not from the back. Hope you've all learned from my mistake there. I certainly have. I'm coming down, and as I like to say, a plane on the ground is a dead plane for this reason. I have just nosed it. Let's see how long I get to sit here while everybody shoots at me. My fanny is high in the air. Finally, they took out my wing. And I'm on fire! And I'm still here, so people are still shooting at me. There goes my other wing. Well, there went a... Uh... Oh, there's a Catalina. And I am dead. Coming back to respawn. And as you can see, we still have a lot of action here at the fields. I come back. This plane is still tier 1 biplane, but it does have the 12-7s. It's in the same tech tree as the G50 series. Yes, don't ask me what I was doing. One death, no kills, no assists, but I'm happy as can be. I managed to get on the tail of this aircraft. Now the fun thing about a biplane is it's slow enough and maneuverable enough that if you can stick somebody's tail, you can stick to somebody's tail. And I just got my first kill. As you notice, the plane is still flying, so I got the pilot. The plane's still in good condition. The pilot's just gone. Checked out. And I'm smoking on fire again. And I'm down. Pilot knocked out. again. We've got plenty of aircraft to choose from. Just gotta pick and choose. Alright, I'm using another reserve aircraft, so this is one of my earlier runs in the German tech tree. This plane, I believe, has two 7.7 millimeter machine guns. And there's another biplane. 
So biplane on biplane. Nope. He just got shot down. So I've got to pick another target. Ooh, ouch. Unfortunately, nope, I was not credited with any of that, so he ran into that tree and that took him down. So if you're asking yourself, do the trees actually work in World or War Thunder? Oh, well, I think that would be a yes. He just ran his tip through the top of the tree. Now you can fly through the edges of trees. You can fly next to trees. Trees aren't bad. Just don't try to fly through a tree. Trees and planes don't mix. Then again, trees and buildings don't mix. Managed to put a few rounds in that kingfisher. Again, another aircraft with a tail gunner. You don't want to stay behind them too long and let their gunner put a few rounds in you. Looks like I was able to take a bit of shrapnel off of that aircraft. And hello! Well, that ended that flight. But I got an assist on that. Next plane. For those of you who do play War Thunder on a regular basis, you can bring in up to five aircraft. So I've already used two, three. I'm now on my fourth, which means I still have one more plane. And at this point in time, I believe I've already used my two aircraft I've already researched. So that leaves me with my three reserves. All three would be German biplanes with the 7.7s. And I see a Catalina. Best way to attack a Catalina? Where it has no guns. Manage not to get any shots on that. I turn around to try and get on the Catalina's tail. Now, if you notice, he does have two waist gunners and a tail gunner. Watch out for where he should be. Fortunately enough, it looks like he's got a closer target to shoot at, multiple targets to shoot at. So if you are going to try and take down a bomber, several people attacking one bomber is always a safe option. As you just saw, that plane that was real close got nailed by the tail gunner from the Catalina. I'm not keeping up with that Catalina, so I break off to try and find another target. And it looks like I found the smoke button.